So today I'm going to do something a little bit different, a bit of change from the glitter glasses and the dotting, mandala dotting I've been doing recently. So today we're going to make something Christmassy. I have lots of these lollipop sticks in my shed. In my craft shed I have lots and lots of different things but this is the thing I picked on today. So I'm going to make these into a quick little uh, Christmas star that you can then paint or decorate or however you wish ready to hang up for Christmas. So it's really really easy you just need a load of these oops, a load of these lollipops sticks and a glue gun you can use other glue it's just glue gun sets pretty quickly and therefore makes it really quick so you put a dob on the end of one of these i keep putting too much glue on and it keeps spurting out the edges so be careful how much you put on and then join these up so we're going to make a triangle out of three so on the top of that one and then just to follow the pattern around that one goes underneath so put that on there and bring that round and just make sure you do it quick enough so that the glue hasn't quite set by then and you can lift it up and bring them round. So then you have one triangle and then we're going to repeat that for the second one and we need two of these triangles for the middle part of this star and then you can either leave it as a small star which I'll show you in a second or you can do what I'm going to do and make it into a larger star. Oops, let's stick that one on and bring that one so that goes underneath. Hold it for a few seconds so that that's try and scrape off the excess otherwise you get excess down underneath but also be careful because of the heat of the glue. And there we go, we have two triangle pieces. Now we're going to tack these together roughly in the middle. We'll make it work, it's fine. So I'm going to do two blobs on the top there and I will secure that one in place. Push that over, try and get that in the right place as much as possible. Oops, avoiding the strings where I can. Strings being the hot glue strings. There we go, and then straighten up where needed, and then tuck in on the edges here, a little bit of glue underneath just to tack them on, and then on the other side too. So, and squeeze that together, and there we go, we have the middle part of the star. You can either leave it like that, taking all the glue strands off. You can either leave it like that, should you wish, and you can have multiples of those hanging up. You can paint it as it is. You can have something dangling in the middle. You can either put um, coloured paper behind it, so then you can have it up as a kind of stained glass star to have at your window as well. Or you can extend it out like I'm going to now. So what I do there is I put a bit of blob there and a blob of glue on each of these spikes. And then I attach two lolly sticks and then I glue them together at the end. Bring them together and glue them together. And then I work my way around the star. So that point and that point. One stick, two stick. one together, moving on round, one there, one there, to go and then what I think I'm going to do with these is I'm going to probably spray paint these I think so that then we can get into all the nooks and crannies and then have them up a couple of different colours I might spray paint them white and add 
maybe a little bit of fake snow onto them maybe. I'm not sure, I'm gonna have a bit of an experiment. What I'll do is while I experiment, I'll probably upload that as a YouTube short, just so you can all see how I do all the different designs. I might do a couple of different options on there. That will come in the next week probably on my channel, so keep an eye out for that. And there we go, it's the last star. Hold that one in place. Sorry, the last star, the last point of the star. Take off the strings where possible. And there we have your star. And that one is now ready to be painted. Like I said, I'm probably gonna spray paint it. And here's one blue peat star that I made earlier. And they're gonna look lovely in the window, hanging at different heights. All different spray painted up different colors. Like I said, I think I may do them white to start with. I may do a couple silver, depending on the color theme of my Christmas this year. Sometimes I do blues and purples, so a really nice sort of turquoisey teal and purples. So I may do white, purple and teal then to match the colors I have on my tree. We shall see. All right, I hope you enjoyed that. Let me know if you try it and do post your pictures in the comments below. Any questions, let me know. And if you've got any other ideas what I could make, Christmas crafts with small lollipops because I still have quite a few left as you can see. So if you've got any ideas please do put them in the comments below. Thank you so much everybody for watching and take care. I'll see you soon.